and uh, and we lost a good friend and a, 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 just a brilliant man, Michael Ratner, Ellen's Ellen's brother, uh, died yesterday at the age of seventy-two. He, as uh, the Philadelphia Inquirer, the Philadelphia Morning News uh, said, as a in their in their uh, obituary of him, uh, they said as a law student at Columbia University, uh, he was. He was radicalized when he witnessed police brutality after students seized campus buildings in 1968. He defied legal odds and even occasional death threats to defend lost causes, gambling that even a verdict against his clients could galvanize public opinion in his favor. Michael was the head of the Center for Constitutional Rights. Uh, his former wife, Margaret Ratner Kunstler, Kunstler, said he was part of that generation of lawyers that was absolutely bold and that understood the political aspects of law. He eventually became the head of the Center for Constitutional Rights. Uh, in his hometown of New York, he successfully fought to end, stop, and frisk. Uh, he challenged America's right to hold prisoners at Guantanamo Bay indefinitely, the, the famous Hamden case. And here's a brilliant quote from him. A permanent war abroad means permanent anger against the United States by those countries and people that will be devastated by U.S. military actions. Hate will increase, not lessen. And the terrible consequences of that hate will be used in turn as justification for more restrictions on civil liberties in the United States. The uh, Philadelphia Daily uh, Morning News, the Philadelphia Inquirer, says he did not le leave us just with a powerful legacy, but with a lesson. Never stop fighting. Amen. Michael Ratner, an American hero. To watch more clips from our programs, hit the Watch More Videos button over here. And please be sure to hit the handy-dandy subscribe button so you'll always be up to date. Tag, you're it.